Hello, my name's Pam Vallely, and I'm the General Secretary for the European Society for Clinical Virology, the ESCV. Our society is truly pan-European, and we have representation from clinical virologists across most European countries. Please do visit our website or follow us on Twitter. Our president is Mariette Feltkamp, who chairs our executive board, comprising eight members, and each of us on the board has a different role and function for the society. We currently have 335 members and from among those is elected a council and we have council members from 20 European countries who help us to run the society and set the strategic direction that we take. We interact with many other societies and bodies including the WHO, ECDC, the Pan American Society for Clinical Virology and of course ESCMID. And ESCV has a special link with the Journal of Clinical Virology, and one of the benefits of membership is a reduced subscription rate to this journal. The ESCV is a non-profit organisation. It was founded in 1997, and since then it's provided a forum for virologists, other scientists and physicians uh, who are interested in any aspect of clinical virology and human viral disease. The aims of the society are to improve knowledge about viruses, both among the public and among healthcare professionals, and particularly in relation to diagnosis and management of viral disease, but also the pathogenesis, the natural history, and treatment and prevention of viral infections. We also focus on lab diagnosis and aim to improve diagnostic methods and promote high standards um, in laboratory diagnostics with strong quality assurance. Our third major aim is to facilitate research and education interactions in clinical virology. So we bring together researchers, clinicians, laboratory diagnostic uh, workers and do all of this at our large annual conference and also at our smaller and more focused regular workshops and via our specialist networks. Our major event of the year is our annual conference which is held in a different European venue each year. Although, of course, for the last two years, these meetings have taken place virtually. So we're really looking forward to a meeting in person for the first time in three years this coming September in the United Kingdom. As well as the annual meeting, each year we hold one or more themed workshops, which is based around a specific topic or theme. Recent examples of these workshops have been, we had one on nosocomial viral infections, another on next generation sequencing in virology, and a third on emerging viral infections. At these workshops, we encourage participation from younger virologists, which gives them the opportunity to discuss their work with more experienced colleagues, but in a very relaxed and informal setting of the workshop. ESCV also supports three specialist networks that are affiliated with the society. So NPEN focuses on non-polio enteroviral infections, NGS on next generation sequencing in virology, and then most recently um, ECI, a network of clinicians and scientists interested in congenital cytomegalovirus infection have uh, affiliated with the society. Every year at the annual meeting, the society makes a number of prestigious awards to established and upcoming virologists to recognize their important contributions uh, in, in the field. And we also support young members by offering travel grants to attend the ESCV conference or, or one of the workshops, and as well as training grants to support uh, short research collaborations between laboratories. And we also offer uh, funding for observerships to attend ECDC training courses in public health. And just to finish, I would love to invite you to attend the meeting I mentioned, the 24th annual conference, which will take place in Manchester in the United Kingdom uh, between the 7th and 10th of September 2022. We've got a great scientific programme in place and we would really love to see you there if you have any interest um, in virology. Thank you.